What's up guys and uh, welcome back to another exciting epic unboxing with your host Nana Natalos. Join me in this video of course is the amazing yet so Disney far away yet also very very close to my heart. And my boy Liam, welcome to the stream. How's it going guys? It's amazing to be here. Glad to be here. Looking forward oh. to this one most of all. Oh yes, and today we're doing an unboxing from the Pokemon side of the house. Now Liam, what do we have in store for today's video? And for today, guys, we have two battle style structure decks that contain five booster packs a piece. Mm -hmm. And we also have a Revoltage Mew V structure deck, which will come with booster packs inside, which we'll open. And then also to finish it off, we have a few random assortment of uh, packs of cards from Sun and Moon, uh, Steel Siege, and the Crimson. We have a variety for us. Lots of goodies, lots of goodies. So without further ado, let's flip over to Liam's camera and let's do this. But before we get there guys, before we get there, definitely check out our previous video where we did the unboxing of Ghosts from the Past. Um, obviously I think we might have two of those videos in store, so definitely check it out. Check both of them out because we pulled some epic cards from that set as well. As always guys, definitely press the like button, show your support for the show, and of course check out our collective domain store, link down below if you guys want to check out some of these cards eventually in store for you to buy. But without further ado, Liam, it's all you. Alright guys, so what we have here are some of the older generation cards. Oh yes. Uh, Nostalgia trip. Honestly, um, I think I don't think I've ever opened a Crimson Invasion card set before. So well, I, this is this is Sun and thing. Moon, right? So um, I yeah, think yeah. I think they came out like between 2017, 2018 time frame. There's the code for you guys, and it's gone. All right, so for Crimson Invasion, the high value cards for this set is the Gyarados GX Secret. The Water Energy Secret and Olivia Full Art. Uh, so the Gyarados is about $62. The Water Energy about $27. And the uh, Olivia is $23. So that's interesting. Yeah. Okay, well, our first energy card is Psychic. We have a Diggersby, a Maoli. It's classic design. So oh yeah. A different design. We have a trainer card called the Counter Catcher. We have a Skiddo. Very interesting little uh, woodsy design. And, yep, and if you guys want to read like the effects from the, from the trainer cards, for example, you're more than welcome to pause the video. We have a Chim a Chim a Chimcho. Chimcho. <laughs> Yeah, a little playful ghost type. Although, if you read some of the Pokedexes from certain, to be to be uh, to be determined, <laughs> we have a I've not seen this one before, a Mistravia. Oh, oh yeah, it's another like, ghost, another ghost type. It look, reminds me of uh, if Quanta had a girlfriend. <laughs> we have a Stuffle, a lovely little playful. We have a Fiba. The bass type Pokemon. Okay, we have a reverse hollow Cubone. But okay. with an amazing, beautiful design artwork. I, I, I'm impressed with that. Wow, like that looks, that, that's really nice. Background. Yeah, that's really nice. And then we have a, for our last card, a Gore Guys. Little mm. evolution from the pumpkin ghost Pokemon. Right, okay. <laughs> that concludes. That concludes the uh, crimson. What's the next pack? Will we next have the Guardians Rising from the Sun and Moon set. All right, this set. Uh, there's a couple of um, high value cards. The number one is uh, Civilian GX, an evolution of Eevee, um, at a secret rare at fifty three dollars. The Lightning Energy oh. Secret Rare at $32. And then the Double Colors Energy Secret as well for $30. Top notch. Top notch. There's the code for you. Hit that up and uh, put it in the system. And for a second time, our energy is Psychic. 
It's a sign. If you didn't see that coming. It's a sign. <laughs> okay, we have a dragon type called Hakamo'o. Okay. And we have a trainer card called Altar of Soon. And we have a support trainer card called Mallow. We have a Wishy Washy. <laughs> Alright, guys. We have a Nose Pass. Oh yeah, no uh, fighting. So it's fighting a very type. strange Pokemon. Yeah, especially to put it as a fighting type when it looks more like a giant block of stone. Right, guys, we have a Wimpod. Interesting, looks like a horseshoe crab. Yeah, I caught um, one of those in uh, in real life. Okay, we have a very absolutely adorable dragon, Gumi. Now, what I like about this very much so is the fact that it. It's very much like the Zubat that uh, I like so much from one of the previous um, uh, unpacking videos. Yes. It's almost like it's an, a knitted version. Right, we've got Whelmer, the giant whale Pokemon. And we have a reversed hollow Lilligant. And for our last card, we have a hollow Absol. Right, guys? The last of the loose packs we have here is the Steam Siege. It's a code from a blast from the past for you guys. Yep. There you and, go. And of course, the uh, high value cards for this one. Um, we have the uh, Gardevoir EX Secret at $23 card. We have the M Gardevoir EX Full Art at $10.61. And of course, we have uh -huh. the Valkarian, Volcanion, I think, uh, EX Secret Rare for nine dollars and twenty one cents. So the first card is a Duelot. Do what? Uh trainer card, we have Steelix Spirit Link. We have a Shield On. A Shield On. Not to be mistaken for a Shield on. A Hoppet. Oh yeah, Hoppet. Almost looks like a Kirby with a uh, green hat. <laughs> Pretty much. And uh, we have a Lickit. Oh sorry, Litwit. Uh classic Mary. Next card is a Krogan. Wow, okay. This is a classic. A Tangela. Very cutesy uh, cartoony design. Oh, too. Tangela. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Very cutesy. Okay, we have a reverse hollow Yanma. I think Tangela got a, a evolution too. Even more tangly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've, I've had a few attempts at trying to catch what its evolved version with a quick ball, but it doesn't want to stay in there. Hmm. Right, guys. And our last card is a Hollow Exuranus, number eighty-four out of one hundred and fourteen. Yeah, if you if you, if you had had the uh, ultra rare version, it would have been three dollars, but that one is only forty-nine cents. Okay, well, it's all good. It's all good. It was just random loose packs we were able to uh, get our hands on randomly. Moving on to the next right. one. Two vivid voltage. A sword and shield, and a break point. Okay, which one do you want to do first? I fancy sword and shield. So sword and shield, the base set. The high value card on there is uh, Marnie, full art, of course, Marnie, at ninety one dollars uh -huh. eighty four cents. The course. the Marnie Rainbow Secret Rare at sixty two dollars, and then we have the Zakion or Zakion V Secret. At fifty-six a dollar, so quite a good set there. There's the code for you guys. Our first card is the energy card. Let's hope that gives us enough energy to keep us fighting for what we might fall. Oh yes. Uh, have a pseudo wudu. We have an elagos. Uh, Eldigo. We have a energy search training. Card. We have a Pharisee or a seed. Oh yeah. Like a seed. Interesting. I remember him. I. Uh, Ah, we have a classic Krabby. Uh, we have a Zigazagoon. Uh, we have a Grossifer. A Silicobra. Even in this one, Talos, it looks sad. <laughs> every every time you see that. Not to be discouraged because we found his older brother. Sandaconda. Is he angry? He's reversed hollow and he's angry. Mm-hmm. <laughs> From sad to angry. And our last card is a Noctowl. Alright, let's crack open this breakpoint. 
All right, break point. Is that X and Y? All right, so on this pack, we have the Skyla um, being at $39. If you guys remember, we've pulled a Skyla before. Um, definitely check that out. Link up above as well. That was a pretty epic unboxing. Um, the next highest rare is a Gyarados EX Secret at $35. And the next one being an M Gyarados EX at $23. And there's a case for you guys. You might find something decent. And definitely let us know in the comments down below what, what cards you get from these packs. Yeah, we, we are sincerely interested. We have a Meow Stick. We have a Heatmore Classic Great Ball Trainer card. We all know and love the Trainer card. It's a classic design as well from, from oh, the old set. It is pretty. All right, guys. We have a Stadium card called Reverse Valley. A Shelter in a very cute one. Uh, you'd expect to see him surrounded by water, not <laughs> by a drought. I know, and, right? It's like he's starving or thirsty. And we have a very strangely named Cricketop. It's almost like Jimmy Crickety. Uh, <laughs> Jimmy Cricket, yeah. Uh, we have a Ratata you guys. A classic Ratata. With his massive teeth. All right. Uh, we have a Froki, a Electabug. Well, guys, we have a Break card. Ladies and gentlemen. Ooh, a break card. Is that what it's yes, called? Break? Please. What the hell is that? What number is that? <laughs> 66 Tranventian break. Uh, that's a, a modest $1.75. Still sleep worthy. That is a humble pull. Two cards in, two packs in out of our uh, first tin. Mm -hmm. so that's not bad. That is not bad, guys. And it's, hor it. it's horizontal, too. That's very interesting. All right, what's next? What's next? All right, guys, we got Vivid Voltage. All right. Obviously, the massive card on that one is, of course, the Pikachu, obviously. Being a massive, Pikachu VMAX being a massive 384, actually, correction, $385.51. But I think that's the average prices. But, of course, price, of course, can go easily up to $400 or more. And the next card after that is a uh, Pikachu V Full Art at $76. Mm -hmm. And Nessa at fifty dollars. So there's all sorts of good goodies to be had in this set, guys. The first one is Energy Green. We have a trainer card called Moo Moo Milk. Uh, sorry, <laughs> Moo Moo Cheese. A Duot. We have a Ferret Thorn. Deal tight. So the evolu evolution of the uh, seedling we pulled from another yeah, other pack. Exactly. We're starting to see some of the brothers and sisters. Brothers and sisters. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. We have a Puchia. Still so very, very cutesy. And then we have a second very cutesy looking dog called a Rock Rock. I think if Pokemons were real, like, I think I, 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 for my Pokemon set, it would, be, it would just be a bunch of dogs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Electric, uh, Blitzel, Skidoo. <laughs> Skidoo. We've seen from the preview previous opening pack. A Forest Seed. So we've just found the little brother of the one we just pulled from previous. And it's a different art design, too. Yeah, we have a reverse hollow sh shield. Say that the shield ninja. Very awesome uh, art design on it too. Fifty nine. Right, and we have a hollow shining, uh, shaman. A modest but yet not sleeve worthy. Sixty three cents. Oh, that's okay. That's, that's not too bad. Yeah, it's a, it's a very cute design card. Another vivid voltage. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Imagine if you pull the Pikachu man, oh damn. Well, we've we've got two other tins that we've got to open of this same type, so we may very well see something absolutely phenomenal. One of my chase cards though is the Pokemon Sensor Lady full art. If you pull that man, I might have to bite <laughs> off of you. <laughs> <laughs> and here's the code for you guys. And we have an energy card for our first energy. Mighty Mighty the evolved version of the dog. Oh, my Dina. Yina. We have sure. a trainer card called Beauty. And we have a energy card. Stone energy. Uh, we have a C dot. In a natural environment. Looks like the forest is like dying though. <laughs> yeah, uh, I kind of feel like uh, he's running along the same area as that shell that we were just looking at. I know, right? Uh, we have a, a Fanfy. We have a Shuppet. He's, he's like an alien in this city. I'm going to take over the world. Yeah, we have another Puchia. 
Fuchiana. If we're pronouncing these incorrectly and you're cringing, we're, we apologize, guys. Classic Voltorb that seems to be done in a very pencil... Almost like it's been done by uh, a sketch artist. Oh yeah, I see that, I see that. A reverse hollow energy card for the aromatic energy. And guys, now, me and Talos were talking about pulling something random out of uh, out of the possibilities. Oh damn. And I mentioned I mentioned the word Charizard, and here we have a Charizard. Oh damn. <laughs> What's but the number on that one? Charizard. Just a normal Charizard. 25 rare? Still a sleeve worthy crazy. card though. Uh, definitely sitting at a nice $4.53. Oh heck yeah. Oh heck uh, yeah. There you oh, go, yeah. Char Charizard. Charizard is always going to have high value. And Charizard, Pikachu, they're, they're always going to have high value. And that's only a rare, guys. It's only a rare. Right, guys. It's the second... Uh, second that we have here out of three. All right, which one you want to do first? Let's, let's go for the Vivid Voltage this time. Being All right. As, uh, we did those last laps. All right, guys. There's the code, and it's out of there. It's out of the three. We have our first Dark Energy. And we have a Swoobat. Macargo. <laughs> okay, we have League Stan. Trainer card. An Electrite. Kind of looks like a dog, but kind of looks like it should be partly grass. Mm, yeah, it, 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 it should be more like more yellow or something. Pine coat? Mm, Mudbray. Okay, Mudbray. Puccinia. So we've had that one already. And guys, we have an adorable Charmander. Ooh, Charmander. Yes, we do. Right there, my friend. My god, it's oh. so, it's so too, it's too cute. It's too cute. It's too, it's too happy. It's too <laughs> happy. <laughs> Alright guys, we have a reverse. Next up, we have a reverse hollow Lugia. Oh, that's cool. I like Lugia. And then for the last card, we have a Garbodor. Probably Lugia. not worth Old much, Garbodor. unfortunately. And this one has the Vivid Voltage Pikachu on this one. Alright guys, the next pack we're opening is the Pikachu one that has the uh, designer Pikachu on this one. And here's a code for you guys. Our first energy is a Grass. And it's green energy. We have Cromorant. Very awesome design Cromorant too. That's the one thing I really like about the uh, Pokemon designs. They're, they're it's always so unique. We have a very nice looking Kakuna. Kakuna Amatada. Ah, uh, yeah. You beat me to a Kakuna Amatadia. He looks like he's having the time of his life, actually. All right, we have a stadium card, trainer card, called the Sorchester Bath. Clobopus. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, player. the boss. Yeah, I remember him. We have an Electrite. And we have... A classic looking execute. execute. I've, I've always liked that Pokemon actually. Okay, we have a Eevee. That's a shooting star almost, the Eevee backdrop. We have a Woombat. A Woobat. A Reverse Hollow Oshwa. And the last one is a Megaro. Uh, Metacross. Metagross. <laughs> Something like that. Alright, guys. Okay, so now we're moving over to Sword and Shield Pack. Come on, Marnie. Come on, Marty. Yeah. Okay, there's the code. Okay, guys. We have Fighting Energy. We have a... A Linoon. The Badger-looking Pokemon. We have one of the nicest-looking Sea Kings I've seen in... Since the original artwork, in my personal opinion. Okay, guys, we have a classic trainer card of Ordinary Rod. We have a Score Bunny. Yep, Starter as well. And, guys... Oh, we damn. mentioned Pikachu. And Hold we in. have a very, a very cutesy looking normal type Pikachu. Okay guys, our next card is a Sinistee. And you can see there it's uh, tea time. Our next card is a Wallow. We have a angry looking shoulder. <laughs> really unlike, so, it's really like, how dare you, how do you put me in <laughs> the, 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 the desert last time? We have a reverse hollow heat more. And for our last card guys, we have a normal Cinderace. A normal Very Cinderace? Strange. What? Yeah. Not, not even a V? Mm -hmm. Hint to a previous video, we do. <laughs> Alright guys, well, another pack we have here for the Breaking Point. Might even pull another Breaking Point card if we're lucky. Because <laughs> we pulled one. But let's see if oh, we can wow. pull a Skylar as well. Yeah, that'd be actually a very nice combination. Alright guys, there's the code. 
And gone. So the first card is Heat More. We have, an, we have a great ball. We've seen that one before as well, Tyler. Okay, a new card. A trainer card. A stadium trainer card. Reverse. No, we've had reverse value before. Our new card is Petalil. Petalil. Alright, guys. We have a Froki. Electro Buzz. We've actually seen already. Boris Seed. We've seen as well. Okay, we have a new card from here, guys. A Espor. Okay, guys. We have a reverse hollow Chikitra. Oh, Chikorita, yeah. One of the starter Pokemon, I believe. Gen 2. All right, guys. Um, well, I think I think you guys must be hitting the like button because we have a Manaphy EX. Ooh, a respectable, respectable $2.23. Nice. Oh, I do appreciate that, man. That's a very, very nice, nice, nice. Nice that card. is that's that's an adorable card. That's how it works in this channel, guys. You press the like, and we get luck. So continue pressing that like button. Now, before we continue, uh, what packs are still left? Uh, we have one four pack of tin left to go, and we still have two five packs of the um, battle style yep. one. Very nice. So let us okay. continue. Start off again with these two. We'll go for the vivid voltage to start again. Come on, Pikachu. Bless us with your cuteness. And there's a code. So we have Psychic. We have a, a, a Trombeak. We have a Hitmontop. Macargo. We've seen. Okay, guys. A new card. We have a Drillbur. A Oshawott. Okay, guys. We have a new card. A Duskull. We have a Rylou. A Rylou. A Reverse Hollow Pineco. And guys, we have a V Steelix. A Steelix V. Ooh, nice. Is that full art? Sleeve worthy at a dollar and fourteen cents. Very nice. Very nice guy. Next vivid voltage pack. We can also get Nessa as well. Bia and uh, Leon as well is in this pack as well. Alright guys, there's the code. Go grab it and let us know what you get. So and our first card is energy uh grass type energy. We have a metang. Mitang. We've had Kakuna already. We've had Mumu's Cheese as well. We've had Skidu. Uh, Shopet, we've already seen. Barrow Seed, we've seen a couple of those. All right, guys. New card, we have Joltik. And uh, we have a next card, we have a Sad Sandial. He kind of he, he kind of flips flop from like a dark to a fighting. Yeah, I guess they they, they chop and change him through the generation, All right, guys? We have a reverse follow Aracuda. For our last card in that one, guys, is a Donphan. The evolved version of the fan fifth that we pulled not that long ago. Next pack. We're going to go for Breakpoint this time, I think. There's the code for you, champion, collector out there. Okay. We have, first off, a Camarot, the uh, volcano-looking Pokemon. We have our first fairy type, guys. We have a... Aroma TC. Wow, look, look at that, the wind blowing in the hair. <laughs> yeah, always got to get the fairies good side. <laughs> mm -hmm. We have a Psychic Siligrus, a Max Potion, Trainer card. We have a Blitzel, a Normal, so the stage one of the fire type we, we pulled first from this pack. Uh, we have one of the most nicest Shinx I've ever seen. Right. I, I can't even describe how cutesy the Shinx look. Damn, that's too cute. Okay, guys, we have a very close contender with the Ducklet. Next up, we have Honig. Now, you guys might notice that this one is a Psychic type rather than a Steel type. All right, guys, well, we have a little surprise. We have, it looks to be, a Reverse Hollow Slowking. Okay. That's one humble-looking Slowking, man. Oh, I know, right? Happy in his, he, he's happy in his abode. Yeah? Next pack. Sword and Shield next. Now, I've had more luck opening these packets, but opening them from the bottom rather than the top. Okay. I mean, that's one technique, sure. And there's the code. All right, guys, we have a energy card. Okay, we have a Drizzle. <laughs> drizzle my fizzle? Ordinary Rod, we've already seen. Here we have a trainer card called BD. Hmm. You guys remember him from the Sword and Shield series? Uh, we have a Ghastly. Ghastly. Next card up, we have uh, Pawnsnod. Pawnstars? What? Hey, I'm Rick, and I... <laughs> 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 and next one we got up, guys, is Fizzlepeed. We have a... Next up, guys, we have Yamper. 
That's the first time we've seen uh, Yamper from this pole session. Okay, uh, Corpus, we've seen. Next up, we have a Reverse Hollow 3 wall. Very nice. And the last card, guys, we have Sentiscorch in a normal form, non hollow. Ah, oh, it's okay. Still more packs to go. Absolutely, guys. Absolutely. Right, guys. So, here we have what looks to be a lunchbox is a small treasure trove. Lots of goodies. So what we have here, guys, but they come with three full shiny of the basic Pokemon, but the full evolved version. Hmm. We have Inteleon, the full shiny. We have Cinderace, full shiny. So, and we have a Rylaboom. On full art. Ooh, yeah. is that a coin? What is that? That is a flip coin as well. That looks nice. So this is a Chirizard Heads or Tails Pokemon. Clearly beautiful. It looks nice, Very yeah. Shiny. I've always liked when they include like um like unique coins or flip coins like that. Yeah, they're, they're always nice little bonuses. We have here okay. The whole mix of cards. Five packs? Five packs, guys. This uh Lunchbox tin. Okay, so two vivid voltages, two sun and moon, and a sword and shield. But hmm. sword and shield still isn't of the battle style. Oh yeah, so uh, I'm guessing this is the vivid vortex box then. As you guys can just about see from the top down view, there's more in these tins than just uh, and what you see at the start. There is a notepad. So if you <laughs> wish to take notes, any... <laughs> that's yeah, awesome though. Huh? Little notepad with designs on the side. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. We can put our, we can put the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh light points when we start. <laughs> Oops, Very different cool. game. Different game. Sorry. Something about Heart of the What? But yeah, they got uh, basic ones, and they they kind of give you a whole bunch of stickers as well, mm. and then a whole bunch of Charizards. Of course, and Pikachu's. Pikachu's and Charizards to represent the set. Kind of gives you a kit and caboodle. Yeah, yeah, binders. Wow! So you can put all your, your favorite cards in there. That's that's so pretty you nifty. Have, you have their favorite cards. You want to put them in these guys here. They come with like sleeves and within them. We've gone through these now, so we should be all right in uh, going straight to the unpacking. Let's do this, guys! Press a like for luck. <laughs> right, we'll do the vivid voltages first. Come on, Pikachu V Max Rainbow. Don't hide from us, Pikachu. I wonder what the ratio is to get a Pikachu. I wonder if it's just as rare, if not more rare, than like one of the uh, high value cars in Yu Gi Oh! That'd be a good thing to look up at some point. One in five cases. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> first code for you guys. There you go. And it's off the screen. Okay, we have Water Energy. That's the first one we've had so far. Yeah, it is. Okay, we have a Nessa card. Nessa? Uh, full art? Yeah, no, just oh. the box standard. The Nessa full art though, that's $39, dude. That'd be nice to get a full art if we can find it, hopefully. Right, guys, next one we have a Crocker Crop. But we have Exadrill, Oswat, which we've actually already seen. Okay, we have Pinecone, we've already seen. Right, guys, next card we have is a Clefairy. Ooh. Right, guys, next up we have Tynamo. We have uh, Milsory, the ghost type Pokemon that seems to be uh, made out of uh, Moo Moo Milk. <laughs> and we have a Reverse Hollow Vaporeon. Ooh. I uh, yeah, Vaporeon is, is, an, is a cool Pokemon. Not my favorite of the Eevee forms though, but still. Alright guys, well, the last card, we have a Pikachu V. Ooh, a full art? A Pikachu V, my friend. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, if you would have had number 44, which is uh, the alternate art. Well, actually, no, sorry, that's the V Max. But the Pokemon, uh, Pikachu V is still a modest card, though, at $2.26. Very nice. Very nice. Plus, it's, it's Pikachu. You know, of course. I mean, what's not to love? However, I mean, the Pikachu V Max, though, that's a $29 card. <laughs> If you guys uh, are collectors, there's a big bad boy Pikachu V next to a tiny one. <laughs> we got the Pikachu out of that. We've got a Pikachu V, so let's see if this one here will bring us the full art. The big V map. Right, there's the code for you guys. Did you guys pull any cool cars? Let us know. Alright guys, we have Steel Energy Type. 
And we have a non-reverse hollow stone energy. I think we pulled a, uh, a reverse hollow of that one. On I believe so, yeah. Right, we have a shuckle. We've seen Cromorant. Good. We've seen Melstery. We've seen Skidoo. Beautiful Eevee with the uh, starlit background. We have a Trubbish. Trubbish? Is that the garbage Pokemon? It is. <laughs> it is a trash bag. Poor, poor little dude. They really did a disservice to him. Shuppet, which we've already seen. Right, guys, we have a new one. We have a reverse hollow. Reverse hollow Beyonce. Yeah, first time I've ever seen that one, I think. Right, guys, well, nice little surprise. We have a hollow the uh, Dialga. The hollow version is 80 cents. Uh, okay, That's not too bad. Not too bad. <laughs> Not quite sleeverly though. Next pack is Sword and Shield. We're still Next waiting on Marnie. Pack, we're hoping she's still going to make an appearance. There's the code for you guys. Right, guys, we have Green Energy, Cor... <laughs> Corvusquire. And we have the classic Thwacky. We have Pokemon Catcher. Okay, we've got Pons... Yeah, we, we, we've seen Pons. Uh, we've seen Squad Bunny. And we have a Nicket. And next card up, guys, we have a Chinchu. A Diglett. Very funky design, like he's in a garden, just doing what Diglets do. <laughs> what do Diglets do? <laughs> we have a reverse hollow Grookey. Our last card, guys, is a Lapras. Oh yeah, Lapras? Non-hollow, just a normal Lapras. Alright guys, next one up, we will be doing a Sun and, Sun and Moon Burning Shadow. Burning Shadows, the high value card, super high value card, is of course the Charizard GX Secret. At a whopping four hundred and forty dollars. Right, guys. There's the code for this pack. From Burning Shadows. The very unique one. We have a fairy type energy. First time we pulled that one from this session. Uh, we have a awesome Metapod. We have a Demisia. We have a Polygon Two. Polygon Two, the evolved version of Polygon One. Crab Brawler. Sebastian's more rough cousin. Nice looking meow. Okay, we've seen Stuffle, Pansage from the uh, original set, yep. from the original starter one, a Krognik, we have a Reverse Hollow Mudbury, and guys, we have a Tapu Fini GX. Ooh. We have a Sleeve Worthy Ultra Rare at $1.59. Very, very nice. Very nice, guys. Hi right, guys, next pack up, we have just normal... Sun and Moon. So from the base set, um, it's the um, Umbreon GX at $41 and Espeon GX at $34. Kick type. And we have a Houndour. It looks like a West Highland Terrier. <laughs> kind of looks like my bash, actually. And a low one Persian. Very funky. We have a Datrick. Sick Growlithe, guys. Beautiful little Growlithe. I love Growlithe. Growlithe is one of my favorite like dog style Pokemon. My God, so cartoonish though. That's like something you see in like, yeah. like um, uh, what is it called? Uh, Adventure Time or something like that. Uh, we have an Alolan Meow, kind of like a dark Meow. A Jupiter, Diglett. Very interesting. A bit of flower. Marine. We have a Reverse Hollow Tashian. The uh, King Julian looking Pokemon <laughs> from Madagascar. And our last card, guys, is a uh, Hariyama. That concludes that tin. Now to this tin. Now this, of course, is the latest and greatest from Battle Styles tins. Uh, we yep. had some pretty good luck so far with our tin collection before, as well as our pin collection, if you guys remember that. Definitely check that out at the very top if you guys want to check out that previous video. Um, hopefully we get some good luck here, and of course, guys, yeah. definitely press the like for luck. Hi. All right, straight to the battle styles, guys. Let's go. And of course, the big high-profile cards here is the Rapid Styles Yushifu VMAX Alternate Art um, at $146.71. And of course, uh, Tyranitar V Alternate Art at $130.75. No. Yeah, yeah. All right, there's a code for you guys. And it's out of there. Right, guys, we had the Dark Energy. And now we have a Swirling... The Scroll of Squirrels. <laughs> scroll of Squirrels. That's, that's a terrible name, especially for someone that, like, it's hard to, like, pronounce words, like, myself. A Buffalo Ant. A Crowdunt. A 
Frillish, a Hound Dora single strike, a Scatterbug. Now, if you get the Hound Doom, the gold version, that's a nice $54 card. Aha. Uh -huh. We have Honage, and we have next up, we have Gilgar. We have a Reverse Hollow Gold Bat. And guys, we have our first Hollow, a Oct uh, an Octillery Rapid Strike. A nice, humble, sleeve worthy $1.22. Very nice, guys. Very, 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 very nice. There's the code for you guys. Okay, so we have. Brass Energy. We have the Urn of Vitality. Single mm. Strike. We have Spoopa. We have a Gil Score. We've just seen that one. We have Roly Coley. <laughs> Jim Checo. We have a classic Onyx. Blast from the past, guys. Blast from the past. Sizzlepede. We have a Glimau. And then our Reverse Hollow is a Conqueror. And our last card is a Normal Primate Single Strike. Oh. Next one is a Sword and Shield Normal, so not Rapid, not um, Battle Style. Is the code for you guys? We could still potentially get a Marnie Full Art, so... We pulled Skyla before, why not Marnie? We, we have. Right, we've got a Psychic. We have a Dottler. We have a Stunkfist. We have a Raboot. The Fire-type Rabbit Pokemon. We have a... Com a Cotmi. A Chowlet. Tulip. We have a Rhyhorn. Ooh, Rhyhorn. That's a different. A Rookity. We have a Krabby. It's a certain different type of design. The Reverse Hollow Rhyhorn. Ooh, okay. To add to that one. <laughs> Which is nice. And the last one in this one is a normal Whimsicott. Ah. That's alright. Two packs left. Guys, press a like for luck. This next pack is a Vivid Voltage. Still get that Pikachu, right? Dude, that'd be so epic. There's the uh, code for you guys, so... Still tight. Okay, we have a Zebrastica. Zebrastica. <laughs> it's like you're trying, like uh, trying to speak like French or something. Exedrill, we've seen one of those. We have a Nosleaf. We have a, a Whooper. But it's not water type, it's fighting type. Okay. Sure, yeah. sure. Okay, we have a Melsory, we've seen... Uh, we have Nikada, a very emotional Whimper. <laughs> Aww. Uh, Wish Wishmer. My guy, he's like crying his eyes out. Right, uh, Drillbur, we've seen that one. We have a Reverse Hollow Lucario, guys. That's cool. Alright, guys, uh, we have a we have a Hollow Xerxes. Okay. Uh, Exernus. Uh, unfortunately, only 68 cents. Okay, fair enough. Last pack. Alright guys, final pack guys. Did you guys press a luck? If you guys didn't press a luck, press a luck now. <laughs> Here's a code for you guys. We can still get an Umbreon here. Okay, cool. Alright, we have our first water energy. We have a Tara Cat. A Tora Cat. A trainer called Crushing Hammer. We have a very classic Poliwhirl. If you guys are part of the OGs, you know what's up. We have a Grubbin. We have a classic Fero. Uh, we have a Maku, uh, Makuhita. Hmm. Makuhita. Uh, we have a less angry Shelter. Is he back in the, okay. the desert again? Oh no. <laughs> no, back underwater where it should be. Next up we have a Togmarudu. Togidimaru. That's a bit of a tricky one. To say, yeah, uh, I don't even want to try to say that one. All right, guys, next up we have a Reverse Hollow ha Herder. And guys, for our, last, for our last card, we have a Primara GX. Ooh, okay. Hopefully this is a good value. How, how much? Well, what number? That's number 42. Nice way to finish it off with a solid $2.22, guys. Top notch. Top, Top notch indeed. Notch. Amazing, absolutely amazing, and that concludes our recording. Uh, concludes our opening session this evening, guys. All right, guys, let's flip over to the main camera and let's talk about some of the higher value cards. All right, guys, uh, Liam, talk, talk to me about your favorite cards from the sets pull. These three would have to be my favorite pulls from the whole box, just purely because of their aesthetically pleasing looks, and two of them are GX cards. We did pull a breaker card, but in all fairness. 
uh, I, I think these kind of look more aesthetically pleasing. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did enjoy it, definitely give us a support by giving us a like. And of course, if you guys want to, definitely check out and join the collective by clicking on that join button and help support the show as well. And you also get exclusive perks by some of these special emojis you can get from us, as well as special discounts from our online store. So definitely check it out. The collective domain link down below. And of course, our Instagram shows the cards that we have currently available for sale. Of course, some more ups and downs. Don't forget, even though we haven't released a video in a while, we have some epic ups and downs coming up as well from suggestions that you guys provided in the descriptions now obviously a lot to talk about we'll definitely see the next time for some more epic videos that's all we got so until next time this is talos and liam signing out hey